Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Clash on Clashington. Today we will be having our second monthly update, featuring 10 brand new cards. And what better way to do it, than by diving right into it. So starting off at numero uno, we got Failmate. A zero action cost basic event, Failmate forces an opponent into calling a clash. Moreover, a timing card above all, Failmate can be nasty in the hands of someone who loves grabbing the clutch in a game of clash. At number two, we get Orc Babby. A level 1 orc minion with 10 buffiness, orc babby provides a little buff bonus to your level 3 minions in its clashington, so they're even harder to take out. At number 3, we have penalty. A surprise event that can protect one of your minions in a clashington from a single effect, penalty is useful when you have a great minion layout on the board and wish to secure it. At number 4, there's peekaboo. A zero action cost basic event, Peekaboo is the ultimate anti-surprise card. At no cost, Peekaboo makes any one of an opponent's active surprise events in a Clashington inactive. And even better, they cannot respond to it. At number 5, we have the Bluffening. A quirky surprise event, the Bluffening is what it states. A unique bluff that can really shake up opponents once it's revealed. I can see many funny plays coming from a card like this. Now, before we move on to numbers 6 to 10, I must state that the following cards are inspired by the YouTuber Al Chessbreach and his Real Life Friends, or RLF, podcast gang. Click the annotation below, or the link in the description, to see the cards on his channel, and also to check them out. Anywho, at number 6, we have Seich. A level 1 VIP minion with 10 buffiness, Seich is able to fish out some extra cards from your deck, and whether they go to your hand or torn up pile depends on how good you are at guessing. Still, Seich can make up in value with a few lucky guesses. At number 7, we have Reggie. A level 1 VIP minion with 20 buffiness, Reggie is equivalent to a sturdy pesky gob, but also has the additional bonus of keeping your hand and torn up pile unrevealed to your opponents. Talk about being confidential. At number 8, we got Nikolai. At level 3 with 35 buffiness, Nikolai is the ultimate circumstance nullifier. Not only does he make circumstances in his Clashington inactive when played, but he also ensures that no more can be played while he's conscious. At number 9, we got Al Chessbreach himself. He may only have 20 buffiness as a level 2 VIP minion, but the ammo tokens he receives can knock out a few little buggers from anywhere on the field. If used properly, Al can easily be a board sweeper. And finally, at number 10, we have Matt. A level 3 VIP with 30 buffiness, Matt allows you to look at the top 3 cards of your deck and add all event cards revealed to your hand. Although the rest go to the torn up pile and Matt loses some buffiness in the process, he's an eventful card that can provide you with many new opportunities. I hope you guys enjoy these 10 brand new cards, and as always, they will be uploaded to the Dropbox upon release of this video. Make sure to keep a lookout for the third monthly update, which should be showing up in early April or so. Until then, I wish you all Clash Commanders the best of luck, and keep on clashing.